Scott, my second question for you is during COVID time, a lot of job seekers are, uh, stress, are stressing out and they want a job now, but they're applying to so many places. And we know as recruiters, when we get any uh, requisition, we are getting more, uh, more than 100 or 200 resume. So what can job seekers do to have that positive mindset and learn from each experience they're doing? I think there's a few things that you can do. And I think you do these, whether you're desperate for a job or whether you're just being strategic with your career. And I think it's a little of it is playing the long game. Um, so I think a lot of people don't really think, uh, they don't think strategically through how their career is gonna play out. So I'll just give you a, for instance, the average person now is staying in a job for about three years. Mm -hmm. So if you're 40 years old, the most people think, well, okay, that's my job. Yeah. And they kind of don't think that if you work until you're 65, that's 25 years. And if you change jobs every three years, you're going to have eight more jobs. Yes. So thinking strategically and playing the long game is really important. There's three things that I think you need to do when you're doing that. The first is you've got to get clarity on what you're really looking for. And oftentimes that means working with a coach, could be a career coach, uh, it could be a mentor, uh, it could be an accountability partner, but I think working with somebody that can give you clarity on what do I really want to do? Mm -hmm. uh, where do I really want to be? I think that's really important. Yes. The next is, I think you have to build your personal brand. Yeah, uh, It's so important. And that's just engaging and sharing. Mm -hmm. And then last, I think you really have to figure out how to network strategically yeah. and really think about how to build your community, how to build your tribe. Yeah. And how to understand what access means. The person with the most access, meaning the person who can get to the most people in this world yes. is going to win. Mm -hmm. So understanding mm -hmm. access is really important. And there's two things. One is identifying it. And then the other is taking action, actually doing something. So if you meet somebody, that person can then give you access to opportunities. Yeah but you have to actually take action for anything to happen. So how do you build those relationships? It's just really important. So those are the three things that I would do uh, if I was a short-term or a long-term job seeker.